Lint Factor's most frequently asked question is what do you do to inspect and clean my dryer vent? The following process is consistent with the Chimney Safety Institute of America and is followed by every CSIA certified Lint Factor technician. This is a very critical factor you should consider when hiring a dryer vent inspection and cleaning company. It is very helpful when we arrive if your laundry room is uncluttered and all items are removed from the top of both the dryer and the washer. The proper testing of the operation of your dryer is best left to a certified appliance repair technician, but is valuable information for you to make a general check of a few critical functions of your dryer. One such test is to check the heating elements. This information is then recorded. Measuring the resistance or back pressure in the dryer exhaust duct is also very instructive when unique problems are being experienced. In some instances, a high back pressure reading could indicate a blockage or restriction in the dryer exhaust system. Lint Factor uses a sensitive differential pressure gauge called a magma helix for this purpose. The proper airflow provided by the dryer's blower motor is another function that may be critical when unique problems are being experienced. When air moves easily through the duct and there is little resistance in the dryer vent, your clothes dry quicker and energy is saved, as well as a few more dollars a month. Lint Factor will make sure to vacuum the hard to reach internal areas of your dryer. The hose that connects the clothes dryer to the exhaust duct, also known as the transition hose, is disconnected from the dryer and inspected and thoroughly cleaned. Depending on the lint buildup, the technician may elect to take it outside. At this point, we remove lint from the vertical exhaust system, from the dryer to the exhaust termination outside, using tools suited for your particular circumstances. In many situations for homes in the villages Florida, we use a motorized brush connected to a set of rods that reach all the way to the roof termination. As the lint is dislodged by the brush, it falls to the base of the stack where it is later vacuumed up by the technician. We suggest that you clean your lint trap after every load of clothes since this is the best chance to limit the lint buildup in the rest of your dryer vent system. Before reinstalling the transition hose, the technician will recommend replacement if this hose is damaged, worn out, or is made of flammable material. The integrity of this transition hose is a safety issue since a proper material, installation, or damage could cause a fire or leak carbon monoxide gas into your living spaces. After proper placement of the ladder, the technician will go to the roof to clean the exhaust hood. The exhaust hood is designed to prevent backdrafts or entry of wildlife into the venting system. Unfortunately, the flapper mechanism contains lint and often presents the most significant blockage. We make sure the hood is cleared of lint and proper operation is verified. Based on the amount of lint that was removed, a final back pressure measurement with the Magna Helix may be necessary before final cleanup. With all of your data measured and recorded, the technician will always be able to show you the before and after measurements and explain if any repairs are necessary before they leave. The technician will also clean the floor and area around the dryer, make sure all connections are tight, verify the gas line is not kinked or electrical plug is secure, then slide the appliances back into place and make sure they are level. Lint Factor is proud to have the following customer testimony from a longtime Villages resident and retired fire marshal. Hi, I'm Barry Fuss. I'm a retired fire marshal from a fire department up in northern Illinois. I was with them for 27 years, investigated a lot of fires, and I wanted to underscore the importance of having the dryer vents clean. Predominantly, the reason for the fire was the lint in the vents. Uh, sometimes it was very sheer items in the dryer itself, but I want to underscore again the importance of having clean vents. Uh, fires uh, that get our in the vents get, can get out of control very, very fast. And it's, you should have them cleaned on a regular basis, six months to a year, of course, depending upon how often you use the dryers. If you use the dryers a lot, definitely get them cleaned on a regular basis. Also, it's very important you clean out the, the lint trap right inside the, the dryer door. Do that every time. And if you do that and you get your uh, the vents cleaned out by a competent uh, company, uh, such as uh, the one Lint Factor that did my home several times, and I observed them doing the job, they did an outstanding job, they were meticulous. So I highly recommend them. Cleaning your, your dryer vents can definitely, definitely save lives. It's that important. It does matter.
All you have to do is make the call and have it done.